the 1970s. It was the decade of disco and bell bottoms. At the box office, Jaws chomped its way into pop culture. The 70s also marked the beginning of Montevallo's mass communication program in, of all places, a barn. I became a mass comm major shortly after the program began in the early 1970s. Studios and classrooms were in a barn, not much to look at. But on the inside, we were working with industry standard equipment, the same that you'd find at the networks and at their affiliates. The faculty taught us the tools of television and how they could be utilized to communicate messages. It all began with learning to think critically, but the access to the professional gear helped to ensure the quality of the product and its use instilled in us the confidence that we needed to succeed. By the late 1980s, the barn wasn't big enough to continue to house our growing program. We needed to expand. In 1991, mass communication moved into its current home. Hi, I'm David Myers, film curator here at the Paul W. Bryant Museum. Also, a 1995 graduate of the University of Montevallo in mass communications, where being prepared was always the name of the game. It's been almost 20 years now since I graduated from the University of Montevallo and I still today use the things I learned back then. Why, just a few weeks ago I was rewiring a rack, dealing with things like sync issues with some faulty cables, some color correction problems. These are all things that I learned while being a student at the University of Montevallo's mass communication program. You can't put a price tag on the value of having that kind of foundation. It has helped me tremendously through my career here at the University of Alabama and the Paul W. Bryant Museum. Mass communication faculty continue to prepare students for the constantly changing media landscape as well as graduate school and law school. And over the last 25 years, mass communication at UM remains a destination program in Alabama for high caliber education in print, broadcast, and web storytelling. My name is Tiffany Westry. I'm a 2009 graduate of the UM Mass Communication Program. The level of encouragement and support that I receive from faculty is unmatched. They really take an active role in nurturing the potential that they see in every student that walks through those doors. And for me, that encouragement extended well beyond graduation, from landing my first job as a TV news reporter in Birmingham to uh, five years later and a career change to public relations. And I know that the quality of the education and the training that students will receive in the mass comm department is only getting better. And now it's time for another upgrade. We're still educating new generations of storytellers, but in the ever-changing media landscape, our vision must be bigger. We must continue to look to the future. We're high definition outside of our building, but we still need a high definition studio and control room space. While our building is about to get bigger to accommodate the communication studies program in the new Strong Hall, we need your help to upgrade our mass communication production spaces to state-of-the-art, high-definition industry standards. Our vision is to continue to be a destination program in Alabama for future media professionals who can excel in the small honors college experience that UM provides. And that's where you come in. Your generous gift can help us upgrade mass communication at the University of Montevallo, securing our program's success for the student's future.